What is that? Look at this. That, Mike, I am so curious what this is. God! It's probably, it's probably sheds. <laughs> it's probably sheds. Yeah. Probably. <laughs> That's what I've seen jumping like that before, sheds. We just, we were driving by and we saw all that jumping and we're like, what is that? So let's, there's only one way to find out. What are we gonna do, Mike? We are gonna cast a net and we're just gonna figure out what kind of fish this is. <laughs> I don't know. This is, this is, we're driving along and like, this is like got our attention. This <laughs> definitely crazy. got my attention. So let's see what we're gonna pull up. What, right. do you, what do you guys do when you see like a whole bunch of fish jumping? <laughs> put down in the comments what you, I know you're gonna watch the whole video, but put down in the comments what you think those are. All right, let's go. Let's see what we got. Do you. Go ahead, get it done. What are you fish? <laughs> Let's see what he got. Dude, it's so freaking heavy. <laughs> oh, snap. Oh, man, don't get it stuck in the... Uh, there's what? something in it. Something? It looked like a... Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> Holy crap! Look at that! Look at that! What is that? It's... That's not a shed. Ow! That's not a shed. Holy... Oh, oh my, my god. god! Oh my god! Look at that! It's catfish! Holy crap! It's armored catfish. It's armored catfish. Is there any regular ones? No, there's all know, armored. I'm never gonna get these out of my net. Dude, I don't know. Dude. Crap! <laughs> Yo, I did, ooh, there's a bluegill. Or a warm mouth. That's a warm mouth, I think. Oh, is it? Yeah, that looks like a warm mouth. Alright, let me get some. Holy crap, man, look at this. Oh, snap, bro. It's like a hundred fish in there. Yo, yo, have you ever pulled up so many fish in one cast like that on freshwater? Not armored catfish. Oh my. Maybe a bait fish. Oh my god. Yo, th those are placosimus, man. Pet stores are be looking for those things. Really? Yeah, that's what you buy. You buy armored catfish? That's so yeah. weird. In the pet store. They're so ugly. What, the, what would you want them for? Algae eaters. <laughs> I think. I mean, they might. I don't know. Just look at this. Oh, my God. Jesus. Look at these guys. Poor guys. Aren't they invasive species, though? <laughs> look at this. Look at that. Have you ever seen anything? Yo, these are neat. These are, this is not a placosimus. I thought it was. No, I think these are invasive. What, what does that mean? We can't throw these back? I wouldn't. Wow, man. We're gonna check up on our law on these things. But look at that. That is just awesome. And the only warm mouth. <laughs> yep, we got one warm mouth. Yeah, he's going back in. Yep. No pond for you. All right. Wow, look at all these fish. Wow. Wow, look at all that, man. I wonder what they taste like. Look at that thing. Oh! <laughs> They're still stuck in my net. Oh my. Mike. I think we just saved the river a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> we may have. Man, if we were doing a catch and cook right now, if we were ready for one, you would be knowing what that is, but that is just way too interesting. Wow, look at that. I did not, dude, I really thought it was gonna be a bunch of shad. <laughs> look. I did too. <laughs> we really thought that was gonna be nothing but shads. Like, I was like, what is that? Like, is that shads, man? Let's find out what it is. I was curious, so I said, nah, let's make a video. We had the camera. <laughs> okay, hit it up with why it's very important about to know what is invasive and what is not. Oh, me? I thought yeah. you were talking to them guys. Yeah, I'm talking okay. to you. Okay, tell us. <laughs> let's Google this. <laughs> This is us trying to figure out why the armored catfish is such a danger to Florida waters. Well, 
um, trying to figure it out here still. So what is the scientific name of that thing? It's the Pterygopolithosis. It's, it's. That right there, whatever that is. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay. So these fish are native to the Amazon River. We're yeah. in Florida. We're in Florida. What it is is people are catching them as pets, you know, Blacosimuses, different types of species, and throwing them in our waterways. What's happening is that these armored catfish, according to Google, they're not only devastating the plant life, but they're also harming manatees. They're just attacking them. They're like they're they're threatening them by eating their vegetation, eating the manatees' food. Um, they're just everywhere. So we're not tr throwing these back because when it comes to an armored catfish and a manatee, what are you thinking? I'll pick the manatee because manatee bacon sounds really good. It does sound good. Oh, they're they're protected. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, just a joke guys. We're not making manatee bacon anytime soon. In fact, we probably be put in prison probably for, <laughs> yeah, for, for, for even talking about it. But in all honesty, like there's sometimes certain things have to die to realize in order for others to flourish. And uh, um, if you want to protect your native species, you have to destroy the invasive species. So we're going to go ahead and humanely dispatch these guys and then um, and call it a day. So we did our... We did our good deed for today. <laughs> Although there's probably 600 million more jumping. Up yeah, there. they're still jumping back there. Wow, that is so crazy. But anyway, that's our awareness to you guys, invasive over native. Well, do you think it's wrong to to dispatch these um, invasive species? Put it down in the comments. But if you like this video, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, follow us on all social media, and never forget to challenge the outdoors. And that's where we at. Thank <laughs> you.